Hey guys, so I am on a walk by myself. This never, well, I, I should say, well, I was gonna say this never happens, although if I can get both kids down for a nap, then I can get out and do a nap, but it is like almost five o'clock, so this never happens at five o'clock. This morning, I went and took the boys. We caught a, a flight with my dad in his personal plane, and we flew to Toledo. So I took video of that. I'll input that here. The boys did so, so good in the airplane ride. Porter hates being in the car in his car seat, but he loved the airplane ride. He just sat on my lap the whole time. He just snacked and played with like the air conditioner and was happy and gray was so good too he's always been good in the plane he just like looked out the window the whole time had some snacks and just like hung out and they were both really really good the reason that i flew them to toledo is because our vacation to nashville slash alabama is tomorrow and we are not going to be taking the kids with us um, so this vacation, I'm sure I've talked about it before. We are going to my cousin's wedding. It's my oldest cousin at my mom's side. And he's getting married near Huntsville, Alabama area. So Huntsville is about seven and a half hour drive from here. There's really no good flights there. So we're just all driving. And on the way to Huntsville is Nashville. And so we're gonna leave a day early and we're going to go and spend one night in Nashville and just see the sights and go out to the bars at night and have fun. And then uh, we'll go to Alabama. We have to do the rehearsal dinner on Friday and then the weddings on Saturday. So none of that sounds like a kid vacation at all. So we asked Anthony's parents if they could watch the kids and they thankfully, thankfully said yes. They're moving their work schedules around to watch the kids. I'm so, so grateful for that. So then came the next task of getting the kids to Toledo, which is where they live. We live in Columbus. I was going to drive them myself, but my dad was already going to Toledo for work anyway. And so we just caught the flight with him. It was super early in the morning, but it was totally worth it. And we left at 8 a.m. And we made it to Colum and we made it to Toledo before nine. It was so, so fast. So, the kids are at Anthony's parents, and now I'm back in Columbus, and I'm just hanging out, a free woman, for a couple days. So, it feels so, so nice to get a break from the kids. After I dropped the kids off at Anthony's parents' house, I had to kill a couple hours because um, my dad had some stuff he had to work on. So, I just did what I wanted to do. <laughs> um, I went to a coffee shop, and I got a coffee, and I just sat in silence, which I could never do with kids. That was awesome. And then um, I went and got lunch at Chipotle. And I never get Chipotle because for some reason, everybody around me does not like it. Anthony's mad about it. And a lot of my families doesn't like it either. I love Chipotle. So I went and got it because I could pick wherever I wanted to go. And I did that. And then um, in Toledo, they have a really um, cute smoothie place. I was gonna go and get ice cream because the thing that Toledo has that Columbus doesn't is cute little ice cream shops that like are only open during the summer. I just feel like Columbus doesn't have that. I don't know. None that I've found anyway. I was gonna go and get ice cream there because they just opened last week. It would have been perfect, but I could not because I gave up ice cream for Lent. So if you know anything about Lent, it's what Catholics do. You give up something or you try to do something that you don't normally do that like betters you or the world or whatever. And you do that for 40 days or something. You do it from Ash Wednesday to Easter. So usually I just give up ice cream. This year I did ice cream and then I'm trying not to complain. I don't think I'm doing a very good job at it, but I'm trying. So anyway, I gave up ice cream. So since I couldn't go get ice cream, I decided I'd get a smoothie instead. So anyway, it was just like a day of me just like chilling, not doing anything, not having to be anywhere for a while and just 
doing what I wanted to do. So that was really nice. And then we got on the plane and flew back to Columbus. And then I went and got my car, um, the car wash near us, they have free vacuums. So I'm too cheap to pay for a car wash, but I went and did the free vacuum. So I vacuumed out my car. I just did it like six months ago, but the kids are so dirty. There was so much dirt and nastiness on the floor. So I vacuumed all that out. And then tell me if your car wash or if you've ever seen anything like this, also free, they had a floor mat washer. And so I could take the floor mats off the bottom of my car and put it in this machine and it had like rollers so it just rolled it along and it washed it and dried it like all in one little machine and then just popped it out and then the mat was clean and dry. I could just put it back in my car. I've never seen something like that. So I thought that was so cool and awesome that it was free. So I went and did that. I came home, saw Anthony, he's still working. And so now I'm on a walk around my neighborhood because it's gorgeous outside. It's like 72 degrees, so warm out and it feels amazing. It's sunny. So I'm outside on a walk, enjoying the weather. I'm just about to finish this up. I'm gonna go back and hang out with Anthony while he finishes up work. I'm gonna chill for a little bit. And then tonight I'm actually meeting up with my mom and sisters and we are gonna go get our nails done. So I'll see if I can vlog any of that. Last time I tried, but it's just kind of awkward. So I might not. So yeah, we're gonna go get our nails done and I'm super excited about that. So yeah, it's just been kind of a fun day, a weird day. It feels like it's the weekend, but it's a Wednesday. Um, and yeah, that's kind of where I'm at. So I just wanted to vlog a little bit now and just tell you about my day. And tomorrow we leave for Nashville in the morning because we have a five and a half hour drive. So I do plan on vlogging. Hopefully I vlog a good amount. We'll see, I always set the bar really high and then I hardly vlog at all, so. We'll see how I do, but definitely stay tuned. I'm really excited for this vacation because it's no kids. It's like our last no kid vacation because the next vacation we go on in June is to Dustin, Florida, and we'll have the kids then. So it won't be a kid free vacation. So this is like the last one. So I have to live it up <laughs> and I'm going to. So I'm very excited and yeah, I'm going to bring you guys along with me. Also, forgot to mention tomorrow, the one night we're in Nashville is St. Patrick's Day. So it is going to be crazy. I mean, Nashville already is crazy. If you've ever been, the people watching there is just crazy. But on St. Patrick's Day too, who knows what we're gonna see. So I am very excited to see how it's gonna be tomorrow. I don't really have a lot of green. I have like a green jacket, so I might just wear that. Um, but I'm just not really a green person, not really a St. Patrick's Day person either. So should be interesting. Anthony and I like never go out on St. Patrick's Day because duh, we have kids. So this should be very interesting. We're gonna act like we have no kids. It's gonna be so crazy. So here we go. Hey guys, so I am back from getting my nails done. I took this quick little clip here of us at the nail salon. It's always so awkward to get those clips in just because there's lots of people around and you have somebody working on your nails. So yeah, I just took a quick clip. But here are my nails. I got kind of more of like a nude peachy color. My problem is I always like the color on the nail polish bottle, but then once it goes on my nails, it's just not the same color as what I thought it was. So this definitely was not the color I thought it was going to be, but it's okay. It's fine. Um, I didn't do sparkle today. I just wasn't feeling the sparkle. Let me show you my toes. Okay, here, okay, here are my toes. I just got like more of a lighter, brighter pinky color. So yeah, I had so much fun with my mom and sisters and sister-in-law catching up. We all got our nails done. It was really fun. And um, I'm just waiting on Anthony to get back. He's out with some friends right now. Um, and then I still need to pack tonight, but I just wanted to sit down. I've been like trying to clean up the house a little bit before we go on vacation, just cause it's never fun to come home to like a, a messy house so I cleaned a little bit and now I'm just sitting because I just feel like it's been a really long day like I've been up since what 6 30 I'm tired it's a oh gosh my hair <laughs> I'm tired it's almost like 10 o'clock it's late so hopefully Anthony comes home soon and um we need to pack I have a couple things in my suitcase but I need to add a lot more so 
I'm so excited for this vacation, but I just wanted to tell you about how nails went. It went so good. And I will pick the camera back up tomorrow for a new vlog of our Nashville slash wedding trip. I hope, I hope, I hope to vlog a lot. Um, we'll see. I'm just now realizing I need to figure out like what I want to do in the car. Like we're going to drive five and a half hours and then on Sunday we're driving seven and a half hours. So I'm like, what am I going to do the whole time? I really don't know. I should have like went to the library and like checked out a book or something. I'm going to have to like look around our house and see if we have any books, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. So I would say leave me suggestions, but we're going tomorrow and this video won't be posted for a few weeks. So yeah, wish me luck on that. But anyway, I'm just going to close out this vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Do you love getting your nails done? What color do you usually get on your nails? Make sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.